Hi, welcome back to the channel. I'm King of Badding. Uh, oh, that's still clicking. I guess it's not gonna stop going. Today's video, we're back in Minecraft for the last time, actually, or at least the last time for a while. Uh, because this is supposed to be a temporary series until I found more games to play and asked my friends basically uh, what games I should play. So I'm going to do something with those. I think I'm going to still, well not think, I'm definitely going to keep XCOM still. And I'll probably put that out twice a week because I like that game a lot. And also I feel like we're never going to get through it. Or at least it's going to take a very long time to get through it. If I don't uh, put it out twice a week. So I'm going to switch to doing that twice a week on Mondays and Fridays. And then on Wednesdays will be one of the new games that someone suggested uh also looking at these they do overheat still i realized that i put them underwater and then surrounded every block with something besides water so there's actually no reason for them to be down for this to be down here anymore uh except for it's a little bit more difficult to do but yeah that's that so today we're gonna do the armor like i said i would i think i have everything set up for it or just about like close enough set up for so it won't take forever to do but the first thing I need to do is find the rest of the dark armor. Because I know I have more in here somewhere. Or at least I have the means to make it actually real quick. I think it's obsidian dust and steel, right? Yeah, so that's going to give us more dark armor. And I have a helmet and pants. I really just need to make boots actually. Do it here. And then hope that I have enough to... Okay, now let's see. To uh, make the rest of them too. Yeah, but this is meant to be temporary because I'm waiting for a mod to be updated and then I can uh. Oops, did not mean to do it like that. Where's that rotted? That's what I'm waiting for. Waiting for one of the mods to be updated, then I'll do like an actual full-on series. I think. That or I'll wait till, um, I need to be doing it from up here because I know everything will drain into here. I'm going to need a bunch of this because, uh, uh, I know a lot of this takes experience. But yeah, this is temporary. I'm going to switch to an XCOM more and then try and get some other new games because why not? I wanted to play some new games. This is going real slow. Are there upgrades for this? I don't think so. Whatever. All right, so we want to take these off. I don't think there's a way to fly with this, but the the real last step in armor, I think, for what I have is draconic stuff. So the sword, the the sword is pretty strong. I think this thing. Hang on, where is that? Draconic pickaxe. That's not what I'm thinking of. There's something that's like stronger than the sword. And I think it's probably a combination of all the other things. But this allows like for flight. I don't know if this armor lets you fly. But anyways. That's something I'll probably look into. Whenever I get to a point where I want to do a full on thing. And I'll probably skip all this beginning stuff. Or maybe I'll start from the very beginning. I don't know actually. Or I'll do a quest based one. Maybe like Skyblock. But that's not as interesting I feel trying to put out content that I would also watch if I wasn't the one creating it. Um, okay, now I remember what I'm doing. So the first thing we need to do is for these upgrades. Come on, fingers. All right, the first thing we need to do for the upgrades are make the blank upgrade, which is dark steel, iron bars, clay, and string. Did I make some of these already? Blank. No, I didn't. So I need dark steel iron bars, which I know I need more dark steel for. Right, so dark steel iron bars, clay and string. Alright. I know it's the, I, yeah, I was gonna say, I should have a bunch of clay from like the clay chicken and string. I should have a bunch of just from over time stuff. And clay. Alright, so that's gonna be going uh, for a while, I guess. I'll show you the house too, because I did finish that. 
And also, no one ever said anything about which weapons to use. So, also, I'm, I am recording this on Monday, the day that the video came out. So maybe there hasn't been time for anyone to comment, but I've also been talking about it for many episodes. But yeah, here's the finished thing. I moved some solar panels up here. The oil actually didn't run out. It just didn't have enough grid power because I kept adding stuff without adding more. So I also put in these little uh, water turbines water mills and there's some over by where the oil is and by the original not the original but where the um fuel is put at too so all of that should be cool um what else while that goes i'm gonna work on the weapon too because i decided what i was gonna do i think i'm gonna use i think i'm gonna use a crossbow come on quit messing up i'm trying to do I'm trying to do tools and then crossbow. So the crossbow takes bolts and then the crossbow itself. So I don't want to use manuelian, so I need to melt some of that down too. Yeah. This this village in here almost died earlier, like right before I started the video. So then my sword equipped and it was taking me a while to get to it. Alright, so So I want manuelian for the for the bolts. I think actually, hang on, let me see, because we need two of those, one of those, string in that, so I'm going to need string, more string, so let me grab some out of this thing, I don't know how much of this I'm going to need, I know on powering it lets you add stuff to it, or it lets it um, be recharged basically, how many do I have so far, only two, I'll take 15 out. All right, so we should be able to do the rest of the work over here while all that stuff goes. Uh, so we need to make the crossbow and hang on one second, get a phone call. So the thing that we're making is a crossbow. So we need the, the tough tool rod, bow limb, tough binding and bow string. So we, we've never made a, t a bow limb and I think I want these to be made out of Manulian. I think I put those in already. I need the stencil table to make a bow limb and a bow string. I think the bow string is just gonna be should just be able to be made from string, right? Like it's not gonna be wood or something, is it? Bow string, yeah, it's not gonna be wood. It's just gonna be a string, right? Hold shift for stats. Okay. So that's easy. I also went and found some more uh, wool while I was on the phone and uh, cut it into strings. So I put more back into the thing so I have more patterns coming out. So now that we have this, I need to get gold too. There's something else I should have made, but I guess since I'm not going to keep making videos, there's a wireless uh, access point for the computer system, which I definitely should have been in made since I made the house where I would also need that uh, the whole setup. Yeah, I might I might still do videos on this, um, but it definitely won't be as step by step as it used to be. It'll probably be like finna fight the dragon, finna do the 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 what whatever it's called. I can't remember right now. Shit, Nether stars come from the wither, so it might be that too. Did I already do the wood? I made that out of wood. Oh, I went and got gold. Okay. So now, yeah, so I'll probably do those, but it won't be like step by step as much as it is now because I got other things I want to do, especially since it was meant to be a temporary uh, series too. There's definitely more manuing than I'll need, but whatever. And what else will I need? I also need to make the bolts. How long into this video am I? Nine minutes? I've been sitting here for <laughs> 40 minutes I'm trying to record it. Oh, well. The goat should be done first, yeah, okay. Only thing I'm hoping for right now is that a creeper doesn't pull up on me too. Uh, yeah, but I do like how this house came out because that's the this is the first time I've made a not straight up square house in a long time. So we want the man Yuli. We're done with this, so six and eight. A creeper almost blew up on top of the house too. Uh, or on top of the workshop, which would have pissed me off. Because first, it, I think it dropped down from the top of the um, the smeltery onto the ground, and I was standing here. I heard it fall, so I flew up, 
came over here, watched it drop down over all of the wiring next to that, and that had to like wait in the distance, so it um didn't destroy everything. Because if it blew up right then, I definitely would have ended the whole series right there. And that, that was between these two little bits of me talking. It was before I got the phone call. Alright, so now I got this that can be poured out. I only need one of those two, although I don't know how many bolts I'll need to make. But it is described as being a, an extremely powerful but slow weapon. So the only downside is that it's slow. Three and one. Wait, hang on. Three. One block, three ingots. Yeah, and it's, I'm pretty sure I looked at that wrong. I don't know why I keep overdoing it when I put stuff in here. Especially since I made it taller. I don't know if I could have made it wider. I actually didn't check that. Also tried to put two of these in. I think I switched this between cameras. It didn't, um, between cameras. Between games. I don't think it lets you put uh, two controllers on one. That's why I have it uh, switched to being on the outside. That can go on there. So we have the string. We have the binding. Right, I think we have the pattern for the other two things. Um, I don't want to make anything out of paper, I think, because it does add an extra modification. Although, also, my sword leveled up between two, so I can add... Um, I can either add the mending moss to it, or I can put another level of sharpness on it. And I think I want to do the sharpness, just to get that damage. Well, I mean, the damage is already at 20. And I know this isn't going to be my final weapon, but I also don't want, to br want it to break or anything, because that's kind of annoying to fix. But it seems like it gains its own. They're, they've been gaining uh, health back anyway, so... Anyways, back to what I was doing. Crossbow. I want to make this out of wood, but I think I want to make this out of bone. So let me go find some bones real quick. So I want the tough rod. That's what this is, right? Tough tool rod to be made from bone. And then I want the tool binding to be made from wood. So I want to gather all this wood for no reason, actually. So now we can make our crossbow. Four. So the crossbow fracture... It does 9.8 damage naturally, and I can make it do more. It has bonus of 6 damage and 3 modifiers on it. Alright, definitely going to put redstone on this for the pullback. And then the next thing we need are these bolts, which I made with, what is this, bolt core and fletchling. So we need to make a pattern for the, is this it? Knife plate off I covered. Well, I know this is the fletchling, which I think is made out of nut string with feathers. So I also went around killing uh, those while I was doing the um, it's an arrow shaft. Killing those while I was on the phone. Where is it at? Arrow shaft, fletchling, chisel head. That's the string. Is this it? Knife blade hand guard that's another guard that's another guard how do you make the bolt it says to a bolt core all right well, i guess i'll look it up all right it actually wasn't that difficult so <coughs> it's made by using the the arrow shaft and then you uh hold up i need to put these in the chest i keep adding them to my inventory instead of just dropping them in the chest so you take the arrow shaft, which I'm going to make from bone, right, and just make, uh, I guess 30 is a full stack. No, 30 is all I can make, actually. Interesting. Okay. So I have the arrow shafts, and then I also want to make the fletchlings, too, which I think can only be made of. Let me test with wood. Yeah, they can only be made with feathers. Yeah, okay. So 12, so I'm not going to be able to make as much as I thought I would. And then it says that you pour whatever um, whatever metal you want over top of it. It should do it, right? Yeah, okay. So it forms on the tip then. This is going to take a while to do. But I'm going to take the one that I have now and see how many this makes. Hopefully it makes more than one at a time. Because that would be uh, preferable. So bolt, core, and fletch. 
Uh, hold shift for stats. Accuracy 100%. Attack 9.27 or 9.72. I don't know how to flip that. Oh, so it does make. Okay, so ammo is 63 here. Okay, so I didn't need to make more than one. That's probably what the shuriken is too then. So, maybe I'll, maybe I'll bring shurikens also. I think I'm going to do that actually. But now I have a bunch of these that I don't actually need. Good thing I have a trash can. Control for more. I don't know how you repair these though. Hmm. Let me, uh... Let me, uh... I'm gonna put the extras away then. Uh, actually, I don't know where those extras just went because my inventory is full. Are they just on the floor over here? They are. So uh, I'm just gonna drop them into this hole here. Oh. Oh, okay. I remember now. Okay, that works out even better actually. Hold up, wait. Okay, come on. I don't know why my computer's uh breathing so hard right now the fans are going pretty fast let me see I don't know why interesting possibly my computer's placement but it's actually pretty the, the where the fans are outside but the rest of it is between two parts of my desk anyways uh, maybe I'll put a picture of that in if I remember to while I'm editing okay so what am I doing now I can put these in here because those are just extras and I have these as extras also so now I need to find something to kill oh yeah I'm, I'm definitely gonna have to put some redstone on this and get it all the way up to what I want it to be okay so like click right to shoot oh that, that works out okay all right I mean that doesn't really count though because it's just a sheep I'm pretty sure those have been dying in one shot for a while now for me but yeah I'm definitely gonna add redstone to this later probably sharpness to the uh to the to the bolts also but I don't need these on my main thing anymore that's the only bone actually I might need this later it's kind of annoying though how I wasted those bones but maybe, I, maybe I can use them as crafting material also so now if that's the case maybe I will make shurikens which I made from knife blades so I did I looked at the knife blades like four times and then still ended up needing to make them so that's pretty cool actually for now I'm just gonna make them out of wood to see how they work and I have a bunch of stuff that I need to put away now, so let me do that right quick, and then get back at it. Sorry. I still have a bunch of this food sitting in here, because it's still pulling out the cherry, since that's the only thing that's been in there. Uh, the power has been um, stabilized since then. I also like the little path that I got going on here, and the trees that surround it. I want to fill the gaps with berry bushes, uh, which will be fun. Or maybe I'll stream this game more. No, I definitely don't feel like doing that. Uh, at least not right now give Minecraft a break because the openness of it means that you can do whatever you want in it but also like to be guided like gently guided close alright cool uh, one wooden knife blade then need to cast this in gold which I oh okay I get it I was gonna say which I just put all of away this going to be my next words. I actually didn't put all of it away too. Which I guess worked out also. Make this out of Mangulian also. But I'm going to need four of these to craft one. Hopefully this cools pretty quickly. It is a really small thing actually. So yeah it's going to cool. I didn't realize these things just spun in circles. When um. When you. When they, you weren't close enough for them to realize it. And I'm going to need them later. If I, uh... For some upper level stuff. Uh, some upper level crafting. Like, um... When I get to the point of getting into the dr draconic stuff that I mentioned earlier. All of that will take nether cores. Or nether stars. Which you get from killing the, um... Wither. 
which you'll need a lot of, so you need to make up a, make a little system for killing the wither uh, automatically. So now we should get a bunch of shurikens. I didn't make these out of all Manulian though, but I should be able to change pieces of them. This gives 87 ammo, and this it says it can be used in the offhand. Okay. Can they be picked up too? Oh, that's cool. I, oh, yeah, this is. Okay, so now I have a crossbow. And, uh. Can the crossbow be used in the offhand? Does it say? Uh. Oh, well. Well, let's see. Now I gotta find something else to kill. Is there anywhere that I can go that I. Oh, duh. I was gonna say, is there anywhere I can go where I know I have stuff to kill? that end because I go in here and just kill um I'm not gonna do that yet actually cause I don't have all my armor done but yeah so that's the two melee weapons done the crossbow and the shurikens and that's what we're gonna be rocking with oops when I come back to this game fully I'm definitely gonna keep the shurikens whole time because they can be used in the offhand I tried it with the cleaver cleaver can be used offhand and neither can the mining stuff but this should all be done now. Yeah, I have a decent amount of these. Okay, so now what I want to do is back to upgrades. Upgrade. And I need to close this tab real quick. All right, back to upgrades. I know I can go, I don't need to do Empowerment 1, which is made from a Vibrant Crystal, which is Vibrant Alloy Chunks, which is a Vibrant Alloy Ingot, which is made by doing energetic alloy with emerald ender pearls now, i think we made some energetic uh whatever is yeah we made these in the last episode but i don't actually need those chunks i feel like it's actually more expensive to make those than it is to make the ender twos which is just a copper ingot with gold nuggets and grains of infinity so i'm gonna do those i need i need four of these which means i need four of these one two of course the thing that i need to more of is arguably the, oh, i pushed the wrong button too i keep forgetting not to shift click in that uh menu so i made one two three four okay and now i can make a bunch of these where'd the rest go oh okay And now to make this, the enhanced one, upgrade for dark steel items depended on, depends on empowered, can be applied to dark steel, needs to be applied to an item. So if I want to, for example, uh, I guess I have to put it on. Uh, uh, helmet, to empower my helmet, I can't because this requires empowerment one to install so i do need to make those okay that makes sense i do have some vibrant i have one vibrant alloy and i have some emeralds okay. and i need to make this is vibrant alloy which i think it's made with inner yeah energetic and ender the funny thing about this is caps lock is what makes me vein mine, which I think I described already. Uh, oh, I forgot I was making more of that too. That's me vein mine, right? But um, I keep forgetting about it and then going to do other stuff like how typing there was all caps. Yeah, so that happens a lot, especially if I go from this to like finishing up homework while a video edits or whatever, while I edit a video. Uh, I can turn this back on too. Yeah, so I'll start typing for fully caps. Oops, that's something I'm gonna do a lot on accident now. It's fun. Oop. It's funny to me also that the left hand is controlled by the right click, and the right hand is controlled by the left click. But it also makes sense. Like it just makes sense to me because I play Minecraft so much that that switch doesn't actually bother me. I guess because the left hand is secondary in this also. Uh, the 
the workshop's gonna sound like an actual workshop now too. Now that everything's gone again. I also put more coal in here because I just wanted to mind it myself and kept it in there since I know I didn't need as much as it as much of it as um otherwise thought. Because at first I didn't save any of it because I was like, oh yeah, I'm just gonna use it for this little application and nothing else. Okay. I should only need one more of these actually. And then I can put the rest away. X. I didn't mean to do that actually because I think I just lost all of my emeralds. Good thing it's only two letters that I need to put in to get that. Alright, so now I can do this and this together. Now the helmet. I can't apply this yet. Why not? How do I make them empowered then? How do I do the or make them shiny? I guess needs to be applied to an item. Open the GUI with Shift right click using dark steel anvil or with the anvil upgrade. Can be applied to any dark steel item. Hmm. It says needs to be applied to an item, can be applied to dark steel. Hope, open the GUI with shift right click. Shift right click, nope. Maybe I have to shift, okay. Hmm, I don't get these things to grow. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's right, okay, I do remember. That's why the tank's full of uh, uh, experience. So then I put this in here. Yeah, okay, all right. And then, I should have one more, right? Yeah, okay. Hopefully this isn't taking huge amounts of whatever the stuff is in here. But yeah, okay, so that's all done. Come on, fingers. All right, there we go. So something that I also could, should be able to do is do the boots too. I'm gonna put on the full set of armor to apply all of this. Which, let's see, do I know the button anymore? F4, mm, three, nope, two, nope, one, nope, five, there we go. This doesn't actually look that cool of armor. So, you know, that's pretty shitty. But whatever. Alright, so this can be applied and that can be applied to all of them. Oops. Oh, you can store in them too. That's pretty good. So, I want it to be modular about it. That will work out. Okay, so now that they are empowered to... I should be able to come over here. Is this charging them? I actually can't tell. Uh, power, 150,000, whatever, whatever it is. How do I charge these? Oh, there it goes. Oh, it's charging from the bottom up. Okay, that's why I didn't see that it was charging. Cool. So, you know. All right, so now that's all fully charged. It says that. Okay. Can I fly with this? That's the only thing now. I can get a glider, an ultra, but I can't fly with it. That's annoying. I think I have an upgrade sitting in here too. Uh, oh, nope. Not in there. In here? I could have swore I had one somewhere. That or I used it to craft something that needed it. Um, oh well. Sorry, let's go try to new stuff now. Let's see if I die instantly or not. Maybe I should empty my inventory out before I go. Um, yeah, I should empty my inventory out first. Oop, can't fly. At the moment, at least. Hmm. The only, the only issue with this armor I can see is the chest plate. Oops, because of I can't fly with it yet. So this should have, that has XP and that got XP from shooting. Hmm. And you don't get the shots back with it, though. But I assume if you, uh... If it runs out of ammo, then you can just repair it with more Manulian, I hope. That's what I'm going to figure it is. 
and then I can add more modifications to it. So maybe that's what's going to get me back into this game. But I will be putting this game up for a while to look into some more stuff and figure out other things. Also just to clean up all the stuff that I said I was going to clean up and never did. Um... Oh, I should, I should get this night vision one, actually. But I probably need a potion of night vision, yeah. All right. So, what did I say I was doing here? That goes in. Uh, I think that's the only thing that actually goes in here. I should put feather falling on my boots. Glider. Fork. Don't know what that does. Let's see. Who needs a hoe when you have a fork? Okay. Inventory, inventory, jump. Should probably get that too. Naturalist. Wait, what's that do? Uh, shows pollinated tree leaves. I guess that's for. That's probably integration from a different game. Not a different game, different mod. Mopo's nearby sounds. Simple solar. Upgrade for dark steel item. Generates more power from the sun. Depends on. Well, I actually want to do this. What is this made with? Can I make these? Is this going to be easy to make? It's not. I mean, it's not going to be that bad either. Let me test this stuff out and then come back to that and see if I still have a decent amount of time left, which I think I do. I'll probably have time to finish that right before. Uh, clay, eye, string, need the food. The book, the book can go in here. All right. This, this. I'm gonna lose this by putting it in here, but whatever. I don't need. I don't need these two in there or that. Okay. Okay. I, now I'm ready to go. Now the auto jump is going to be useful again instead of it being the free runners that give me up stuff. Oh my god, what, what is that sound? Why does it sound like so much stuff is going to hurt? Did I accidentally send through a bunch of... What you call it? That wasn't bad. Let's see. That didn't, I don't think that accurately showed it though. Oop. Okay, so let's see. It's at full health. One hit takes it to half. So it takes three hits to kill those. That's not bad. That's pretty good. Uh, it doesn't look like the armor is doing as good as it used to do. Alright, let's try the crossbow now. Alright, I figured this would be a one shot though, because it said it was supposed to be super strong. Yeah, that's not bad. Let me get away from this, because I hear a gas, and they can shoot and break the uh, thing. Oops. Alright, I guess all of those are gone now. Hmm. That's annoying. Let's see. The blaze spawner. And... I think the crossbow was the right choice because now the longbow takes a long time to pull back and I think it can be unsteady while the crossbow seems to be pretty steady from the jump but it just takes a long time to pull back and that's it really I think that's the only down downside to it so I can just point and click to uh, shoot exactly where I want this daylight savings is messing me up too give me a give me a, I was gonna oop okay so you at least get killed in one shot now Although, it, it isn't too bad, actually, the pullback. Alright, come over here. Two, three. Yeah, okay, neither of these are that bad. I want to change the... I want to change the... the Some of the pieces of the uh, shuriken so I can get the benefits of other... Uh, materials that you can craft with. Like, the bone adds damage to it. I think wood adds durability. Maybe to add um, the amount that I have in here naturally, so they last a little bit longer. Yeah, and then I can add other modifications to these things. But oh, I don't have a new portal thing, do I? 
So I just lost where I was. I don't want to teleport to the death because I definitely burned. Hmm. Can I teleport out of here? Because I definitely didn't do this right. Workshop. 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 Teleport? Okay. Cool. I'm not doing that again. That seems a little bit cheaty. The teleporting between dimensions, so. Oops. I gotta. I, can I, how hard is it to take these off? If I put this in. Nah, okay. I guess I should just be leaving an open space for it. But. Do I have time? I have a little bit of time. So let's go add a few more of these attachments that we can do. Some of the upgrades that we have to do also. So I want the night vision. I only have one character. Maybe I can do the fork? Now nah, I'm gonna... I have appetite, don't I? App... Uh, I, meant, I meant this stuff too. Do I have the dust? I don't. I don't have appetite dust. I need lapis dust too for the solar thing that I saw also. So the crusher, I can put this in there, and this in here, right? Now this is made with sand, isn't it? Appetite dust is like this? Nah, how do you make the... Damn. Damn, I took it from me. E, U, oh it is sand, let's have the wrong order, okay. Almost had it. Hello? Is that what I can, I can cut past like this part where I'm showing stuff. Maybe I'll just split this, split this into two series where one is doing stuff and one is setting stuff up. Maybe that's what I'll do. But either way, Minecraft will still be on a hiatus, I guess. I'm gonna come back to it though. Once people start playing Minecraft, they usually don't leave it forever. Until you leave it forever. I guess the only reason you leave it forever is you grew up, though. Yeah, so this is the draconic stuff. I don't know why this is popping up right now. But you need this, which takes these wyvern energy cores, which is this. It's a whole, it's very expensive, my Definitely, like, an in-game one. I don't even know. My sword now does more than 22.5 damage, right? Or it can. It does 20.16, which makes this pretty useless. What does this one do? 45 damage? That makes more sense. But, oh, they have shields too. That's leggings? Interesting. Whatever, getting distracted. I need a, a table. I need a potion. Brewing stand. There we go. Do I have one? I thought I had one actually. Oops. No, I don't. Let's see. All right, brewing stand, and then I need to do need blaze powder. Blaze powder goes here. Potion of night vision. Golden carry. Okay, gonna need awkward potion, which is nether wart, which I think I have too. Yeah, I do. All right. I need bottles. All right. So this, this, this sand. I don't need that many, so I'm not trying to make a huge amount. I think I have a bunch of this water all over the place, too. Alright. I actually only need one of these, so this might be a waste, but whatever. I just drink the rest for fun.
Alright, while that goes, I can go back into the upgrade night vision. Yeah, I just need any portion of night vision and I can get that. What else do I want to do? I can't, I don't really have anything to do for empowering more. Do jump, but he's probably going to need, oh, it's not what I expected them to be. Six levels to activate it, dark steel boots, painted on jump. So I do need to get all of the other jump uh, specification, specifications. Don't need that, don't need the muffle. The solar panels is also what I was trying to make. So how would you make this? Solar one. Say so with this, which is the lapis dust and the coal powder. Did I already put the coal in? I didn't. Oops, I only grabbed one. Okay, the coal can go in also. I had a feeling that coal was supposed to go in there, but I did not remember to put it in there anyways. Alright, that can go. Hopefully this, th that, whatever, alright, whatever. Yes, I was there before, so whatever. Uh, that, this can go back in. I think these carrots can go back in. The gold nugget, that, the sand, the glass, the wheat. That's the sound of that finishing. So now, let's see, let's see. Upgrades, this one, recipe. Blank. Where did I put the dark steel upgrades? Hmm. Oh, I did have one of magnet. Teleport mine things directly into your inventory dependent on empowered dark steel weapons and dark steel tools. I guess oh, I did have boots in there. So I didn't need to, I actually didn't need to make any of the armor that I think. What happened to my blank patterns? Did I put those on that chest up top? Let me grab this stuff too before I run up there. Hopefully I did. Or did I leave them, yeah, I was trying to say, or did I leave them sitting in the thing so it couldn't be pulled back out? Okay, I'll put them in there. I think I just left that other one downstairs in the thing. Jesus Christ. Something needs to be down here anyways, actually, so. Okay, so that's set up. That's gonna go on our helmet. Right, I should be able, can I do it from here? I said shift right click them into this oh cool is it night time tried to fly up still can't fly all right now i can test this underwater actually so teleport to the quarry power and i should be able to see if, yeah okay so it, it is working that's why it looks like i can see straight out into the distance now before you wouldn't be able to see that far just be dark it's not as useful underwater, but it does help a little bit. There's, is there ever something there? I feel like I'm missing something right there. Oh well. Oops. All right, and then I was trying to make the photo stuff. It's made from nether quartz dust. I'm nether quartz dust. What other dust do I have? Okay, so I can cook this into silicon, right? Let's get a uh, let's get a few pieces of this. Mm -mm -mm. What are we doing? We're doing the power can be applied to the dark steel helmet. So I don't need a bunch of these. I only need the one. This needs to go, does it need to go into an alloy smelter? That's the question now. A simple solar. This is where I should be starting it, right? Because this needs, and this one does need the simple solar. I was definitely finna say, like, I feel like this isn't where I was actually finna start it. Put all of these in there. Oops. 
I feel like it just poured some other stuff that I didn't think it was supposed to. Because I definitely didn't have this much. But whatever. So this gets... I, I should be able to just... Right? Nah, okay. This process that I said wasn't going to take too long seems to be going a little bit longer than I thought it would. But whatever. Okay, so that's going to cook up. Simple solar. I have, do I have electric steel? Electric, I don't. Hmm. <laughs> All right, steel. And I've already forgotten what the other one was. Electric steel is steel and silicon. Silly. It's like this, right? Was it in here? Cool. Okay, so both of these can go at the same time. I think I have this stuff, right? This is... This. Which is... I have to remember how to make this quite clear glass. Glass and that. Oh, fuck. It's glass. I've been doing sand. Well, it said sand it will work on the thing, and then I never even. I just looked at it, it said glass, and still didn't do it. Guess I don't have to cheat in it, huh? That worked out. Great. Yeah, see, that's part of why I want to just figure stuff out so I can get past dumb shit like that happening. Alright, anyways, this thing is now done. So this should mean that I can power... Wait. This means now that I should be able to power my suit uh, just on its own. Hang on, let me find it again, goddammit. So, I need to run to the bottom now. Not enough in that one. Should be enough in this one though. Also, I should put all of that back before I lose it. Okay. Shift right click on the helmet. Put the, put this wherever it applies. All right, so now, the durability is still going to go down because it's only in power 2. But I have 14.805 power right now. And yeah, so it's, tr it's ticking up slowly over time. So does it do it for all armor? It will do it for all of the armor. Yeah, that is pretty good. Yeah, so that's going to be all for Minecraft for a while. Oops. Oh. Hmm. Does, does it automatically do feather falling? I definitely should have taken damage from one of those falls. So yeah, that's pretty good. The only thing I can do then is fly. Hang on, let me, let me make sure. Yeah, but uh, thanks for watching. Uh, that's going to be it for Minecraft for a while. Yeah, okay, cool. Then the free runners are now useless. And we'll go into the chest that will deem for useless. Now obsolete shit. Which this armor will end up in probably all of these weapons. And uh, the jetpack too. Although the jetpack is still pretty useful right now. But yeah, so thanks for watching. I'm going to keep playing this on my own though. Uh, there's more videos to come though. So be looking for those. Bye.